What's up, Wayne Barron here with Dark Effects TV. Uh, it's out of Windows 7. I'm uh, getting ready to do some After Effects projects, and my After Effects is installed inside of my uh, Visual Effects G Drive. And unfortunately, my G Drive, as you can see up here, is down to 12 gigs. And so what I want to do is that I want to take some from my Office Drive, which is uh, still available at 37 gigs, out of 39 so I don't know why I didn't make that one smaller and then give it over to here so uh, this is the first time that I've ever used the shrink in the extend inside of Windows 7 and uh, I've never been a big fan of how other programs worked uh, so but I uh, for what my understanding is, is that Windows 7 uh, does it and uh, it's supposed to work pretty daggone good so let's go ahead and give it a shot and see what happens so the first thing I want to do is that I want to shrink my office drive so we go down to shrink volume give it a second let it load okay and the amount of space that you want to shrink so we've got 36 here so uh, since office drive uh, is mainly for my office work I'm I want to go ahead and uh, take away uh, 20 one two three so I'm going to take away uh, basically 20 gigs from my 40 so let's go ahead and click on shrink okay and this is my unallocated space right here and then it brought down my office to 19.53 gigs and gave me 19.53 gigs of unallocated space so now what I want to do is I want my visual effects to be extended so let's go over here and click on extend also if you do not have any available space then you, your extend, like your mirror right here, will be uh, enabled. You will not be able to click on extend if you do not have any unallocated space available. So make sure that you got some space available and you choose extend. Click on next. And let's see here, total volume size in megabytes is uh, 5.2. And so... Um, I want to go ahead and move that here. So uh, selected is the 19, which is right here. So let's click on next, and then click on finish, and then uh, I reckon that's how it does it. So uh, my G drive is um, okay. So uh, it creates two partitions, but it's uh, only showing up inside of your my computer as one partition. So now I've got 51 gigs instead of the 30 something that was originally there. And so anyway, uh, now I've got some space to where I can uh, now work inside of After Effects a lot better. So hope that y'all enjoyed this uh, Windows 7. Uh, shrink and extend partition um, instructional video and y'all have a rocking week